Sister Vincentia was a very special person. Everybody at St. Joe's knows that. She was a strong person, a strong personality, loads of fun, and deeply serious. Sister Vincentia Dorsey served as the administrator of St. Joseph Center from 1991 to 2001. To her, every life was sacred. So for her to have the responsibility of being in charge of making sure that all these wonderful people got quality care all the time and knew they were loved all the time, that meant everything to her. She was a high energy person and I think what people will always remember her for is as a champion of those most in need. Everybody has a different personal style and Vincentia always told it like it was. And if things were tough or if she had to be in Harrisburg fighting for money, well, look out <laughs> because she was going to go down and fight for her kids. Sister Vincentia showed great leadership at St. Joseph's, but she also had incredible humility. She would tell you she never felt worthy. We knew she was more than worthy, but she just never felt worthy. She was always in awe of the fact that God had called her at all, let alone brought her to St. Joe's. During Sister Vincentia's tenure, St. Joseph's grew. Sister Vincentia had a great commitment to strategic planning, you know, taking a longer look, not just at what we do well now, but what does the next generation need and how can we be best prepared. During her tenure, the St. Joseph's Aquatic Therapy Pool and the growth of outpatient aquatic therapy came to fruition. Sister Mary Alice recalls Sister Vincentia's response to the inception of the WNEP Go Joe Ride. In the 1990s, while Sister Vincentia was the administrator of St. Joseph's, there was a weekend meteorologist who wanted to start a bike ride. And she said, sure, we'll be a part of that. And thank God she did because look at where we are 26 years later, how much uh, Gojo has allowed the community of Northeastern and Central Pennsylvania to know about the good work of St. Joseph Center and for us to receive their charity and to really be the beneficiaries of so much kindness. Joe Snedeker was asked why he does the ride and his answer touched Sister Vincentia. And he said, just like that, I have three healthy children. So it told me the world about him. He does it right out of his heart, and that's what she knew and what she responded to. She said that this man really cares about the kids. All right, so when I first started the ride, I was barely 30 years old, and sister was new to me and the whole St. Joe's uh, overlap with the bike ride, and I was a little nervous. But at the end of the ride, I remember sister was so happy with me, I met her, and I said, uh, I mean, is it okay to hug and kiss a nun? There at the telethon, the festival, we were all coming together, the donation. And she said, sure. And we gave each other a big hug and a kiss. And she turned out to be such a fun loving person. As an IHM sister, Sister Vincentia shares with all of us our IHM charism, which is to believe in the unconditional love of God for all people. And so in her interactions, whether with boards or staff or the people that we support, our residents and clients, she brought that into the conversation. So she would always begin, whether in words or at least in her thoughts, to say the person sitting across from me is uh, equally loved by God. 